it's Skyla, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Today is going to be a haul video. Now, <laughs> how can I explain it? <laughs> a couple of days ago I went to Lush and I've got a few little bits. I haven't had the chance to show you because I wanted to go to Boots. Yes, boots. <laughs> I haven't been in boots in months and months and months. And there's a reason why I wanted to go to boots. Because I had, I'll explain to it right, in, for people that don't live in the UK, I'll explain it to you. Um, you get this advantage card and you get points on the card and then you get certain amount of points towards products that you can you pay with your points so basically your items are free and that's what I've done <laughs> on my boot haul <laughs> so I got one two three four six seven items here completely free use my points and I still have points left over so you probably go under why does she need this and why does she need that? I picked up things because I wanted to try them out and if they didn't agree with me I can just go. There you go. <laughs> Throw them away because they were, they were for free so why not? So first thing I'm showing you is a 75ml aloe soothe hand cream for dry skin because I get very dry hands and I saw this this was for 50p but obviously I got it for free with my points so and it does have that aloe spell for it and it also has SPF 15 so a good little thing to take with you on holidays to protect your hands from the sun so I got this <laughs> Next, I got this big boy, <laughs> 400ml can of L'Oreal Studio Pro Fixing Hairspray. Obviously, I had to have my hair needed fixing <laughs> for my passport for draft, but that'll be all told all in a vlog because I need to do a vlog because <laughs> it's a long time overdue. <laughs> so, I got this Studio Pro Locket Fixing Hairspray. So it's quite big. I this was two ninety nine. <laughs> there we go. Sorry about that. Uh, next, I got. Well, when I first picked this up, I thought, oh, I'll try blusher from the natural collection because I know these are against animal testing. So I've been told. <laughs> And then when it come out, I didn't realise I actually got the pressed powder in shade cool. Oh, <laughs> dropped it. So that's what it looks like. Can't really tell, but that's the label to it. It's like, let's do a quick swatch. You can't really tell, but it is quite light on my skin, which I. Lately, my skin <laughs> needed a lighter shade, so I've got this to try out. This was, I think this was $1.99. Yeah, the remaining products here were all like £2, something like that. I had like a few quid left over, so that's why I got all this for free. So, yeah, that's the pressed powder. Speaking of natural collection. I got the Moisture Shine Lipstick, High Shine Lipstick that gently moisturises the lips, fragrance free, in the shade Candy Mist. So that's the <laughs> label. <laughs> so let's do a quick swatch of this. <sighs> I don't know if you can see that. Of the it's quite light but I 
like light colors you know for like daytime wear so I got this to try out obviously the next thing I got I got two of them I opened one I tried it already it is the Miss Sporty Perfect Stay last up to 10 hours press powder in the shade not not one light comes like this it's like like quite handy because it has a mirror so of course I got two this one isn't opened and also in the shade light so I don't know if you can see I've used a little bit of this already just to try it out the only thing, the only disadvantage that I do not like with this is this, so I'll be using a brush with it. I'm like, do I really need this? No. <laughs> so I got two of them. Which I'm starting to wear a bit of, like foundation a lot more and my eyebrows and then we do it again. So I got two of these, so two of them. So last but not least on the Boots haul for free, I got the collection, it's collection 2000, up to 7 day wear nail polish in shade Milk Caramel, number 17, so, and I don't know whether you can see the colour on the it's like a new like a pink nudie colour like like a shimmery nude and that was like everything there was free and I still had I was like three or four pound points left over. So which brings me on to this little bad boy. <laughs> I only got one, two, three, one, two, three, about six items in here. So, so I can tell you the prices of these. Just move my little boot hole out the way. First thing I got is the Think Pink Bath Bomb. I've had this before but that's what it looks like and of course it's got lavender, tonka absolute, vanilla, neroli oil so oh. and let me tell you before I carry on um, let me know you guys if you like me doing like when I do my haul videos you like me doing it like this so because I think it's a bit more comfortable for me doing it this way so what's next is the butterball bath bomb um, this has cocoa butter ylang ylang oil synthetic musk, musk and this is really nice and soothing for the skin and someone that this bath bomb is suitable for like people that you don't really like having nice baths if you just want like a, a clearish whitish colour water and this smells a bit like honeyish so that is the Ball. I know it's tiny but this is so soothing for your skin so I don't think I don't think the bath bombs are vegan because I haven't really that doesn't really say if they're vegan so I think these are more like vegetarian but I can find out um, Next is a big one. Um, this has popping candy, prima tartar, cinnamon leaf, 
Tessie Green Oil, Ylang Ylang Oil, Oak Moss, Lemonine, and this is Preservative Free, and this is the Fizz Banger Bath Bomb. <laughs> I, oh, I do like this one, I love the colour of it and it does get everywhere. This smells right lemony. You can smell like, like citrusy lemony and you've got like bits of blue in this as well so, and it does get everywhere. So. again this has shea butter cocoa butter almond glycerines extra virgin coconut oil almond oil sandalwood oil lemon oil and fair trade vanilla pod and dry fair trade vanilla and limonene which is good for my skin and of course, we're on about the Floating Island Bath Mills. It's a reoccurring product that I really like to get all the time. And you can smell the vanilla in this. Um, what I like about this is when you mix it with like a... Say for example, you just want like a nice soothing bath. But you don't want flashy colours. I would highly recommend putting this in with the Sakura. Or the butterball bath bomb if you just want something subtle but if you want some subtleness or some out of control craziness coloring i would actually go with the um oh maybe the big blue or the intergalactic or possibly the yoga bomb or the fizz banger so that's the floating island bath melt Four down, two to go. Next, I am excited about this one. So, anyway, prices: Fizz Banger three pound fifty, Butterball, and Think Pink small bath bombs were two sixty or two sixty five. Floating Island was two pounds. I mean, we paid about twenty pound for all this, and it's well worth it. So next is a massage bar that I've desperately wanted for a long time. It has cocoa butter, shea butter, honey, cocoa powder, perfume, almond oil, glycerin, sweet wild orange oil, bergamot oil and limonene. And this is, I have to pronounce this right, it's the soft, soft care or coir massage bar. And it comes in this little heart. So, this smells absolutely fabulous. This was $4.95. Highly recommended. Love it. So, now, yeah, that was $4.95. So, that was the Soft Career Massage Bar. And last but not least, this is something I wanted for ages and I finally got it. This was four seventy five. This may I add, this product was made by Ashley on the 29th of February this year and it's used by the 29th of the 9th, 2018. This is the first product I have in my hand that I don't have to I can take my time with it. So ingredients are cornstarch, kaolin. Fair trade organic cocoa butter, cow cow, magnesium carbonate, jasmine absolute, velvety oil, cinnamon, and linalool, and it's self preserving, so this will last a long time. And it is, of course, the silky underwear dusting powder. Now, how you use this is the massage bar I'll give you a hand. Uh, once you put the massage bar on yourself 
you may find that it's a little bit greasy, a bit sticky, whack this on over it and it'll be amazing and the smell, the smell is just fabulous. Um, this was £4.75 <laughs> so I got six products that was for £20 so not bad going. Um, what else was I going to say to you? So, yeah, they were my hauls, and sorry, it's been a bit too long. So, I hope you like this video, and it'll go up in a minute, I hope. So, stay gory, have unpleasant dreams, and I may see you soon with a vlog because I, I really need to get done with this vlog because I've got a very, very exciting thing coming up. So, stay gory, have unpleasant dreams, and I will definitely see you all soon. Ta-ta for now. Bye.